Your ID5100 is supplied with some editing software called the CS5100. You can save files onto a memory card in your radio and then import them into this software for editing. Or you can download files from the ICON website uh, with some default files. Those files uh, can also be updated and I'll show you here how, you, how to update different sections within them. So if we go to File, Open. When you open a file you're opening an ICF file and ICF files contain all the information that is programmed within the radio. Um, it has all the memory settings, all the memory channels and everything else that you've changed within the radio including your call sign, location, etc. So it's an ID5100 we're dealing with here. And you'll see now that the repeater list has been populated with the UK analog repeaters, digital repeaters, and also the UK DV nodes and FM nodes, and a selection of repeaters from throughout the world that you can use in the software. We're going to update this ICF file with a file that's uh, on the ICON website. I've previously downloaded them onto the local machine. Now the files for updating it are not ICF files so you need to make sure that you import them and you need to import them in the uh, correct sections. We're going to uh, import into the repeater list section and if we go to group I'm going to import a CSV file I want to overwrite this existing one here and this is the UK D star UHF repeaters and you'll see here that I have a UK D star UHF repeaters dot all CSV all the files on our website ending in all are used within the repeater list section and it's important you make sure you get the right files for the right section or they won't import. So if we highlight that file, do open, it'll ask, ask you whether you want to overwrite. And yes, we do. So we've now overwritten just that section within the uh, list of repeaters and updated it to the latest list. Once that's been done, you can save the file back. So we're going to save as, because we now want to create a file that we can put back into the radio. And as I said, they end in ICF. So we're going to create a file, which is the 29th. Save. And we now have a file that we can put onto our SD card. Take over to the radio and import and update all the repeater listings within the radio.